Hi Libra, welcome to my channel. This is your reading for the next month. Let's see, what do we have for your Libra quick message? It's a general reading, so take us as resonate and leave the rest. I do offer personal reading Libra if you're interested. Check the description box below. Your first card is solitude. I see you spending time alone on your own. It's a period of reflection. You need to take care of yourself. You are exhausted, Libra. You're manifesting a change in your life. Yes. So medicine showing up. Let's see what do you need to focus, Libra. Making an important decision about the future. You can be talking about a relocation. Moving, traveling very soon. I feel like because there is a new job offer, a new connection here, but at the distance. But you don't see coming with the five of wands. It's a training, a formation, working in collaboration with others. Let's see. A message with a bell in a deck. So we have for you, Libra. You're not the same. It's like your rebirth, the phoenix energy. It's you, you're not giving up. You're finding a solution. You can be proud of yourself. You've been through a lot, Libra. I see you facing difficulties about your finances. You need to know how intelligent you are. I see you learning your skills like a student, taking a risk, trying something different from your past. It's a progression in your career, Libra. Let's show you. Don't lower your standard. It's a red flag here. You know exactly what you really want. So there is a significant change about your love life. Libra. Friends of you are here for you. I feel like someone you already know, someone you can trust, is going to guide you, to help you about relationship here. It's like it's time for you to see the truth. Okay? I feel like you've been dealing with someone inconsistent, maybe a little bit manipulative. You've been very patient with this person, but this friend here is going to help you. Okay. You need to know, Libra, that this is the best. Okay. The best, Katrina, for you. Abundance, great fortune here. An advice. Not silly, Libra. We have Gemini energy. Speak your word into being. Communication, honesty is important for you. Okay? You don't want to feel confused or insecure anymore. But you don't see coming. We have the whale. It's about wisdom, learning from the past. You don't want to repeat the same cycles again and again. Let's see. New animal spirit next month. Libra.
we have the Beaver Spirit Lay of Solid Foundation. Stability about relationship is important to you, okay? There is a significant change about your love life here. The number six, it's a confirmation. Let's see, three cards about relationship. What do we have for you, Beaver? I see you ending a connection, a friendship, or relationship. It's a lot of pain here. But you know exactly what you really want. You have your power back. There's a tree of salt here. We use a page of wands. It's telling me that you've been dealing with someone maybe a little bit younger of you or immature. Okay? Let's see. A separation, a breakup, choosing to end situation, ending a cycle. This is death card. A new door is open for you, but something very different from your past. This is a tree of salt. We have the page of salt. Confirmation dealing with someone immature, a lot of delay insecurity from this connection here and confusion. The Queen of Wands, your energy is very positive and beautiful. We have a the Emperor showing up. Some more mature, maybe a father figure is coming for you. Aries energy, an entrepreneur, someone with a lot of security and power. Hermit Energy Vehicle. Let's see. You're going to be with someone very independent, is telling me. Libra. Focus about what you really want. It's like your wish come true. You're making a sacrifice about your love life. Protecting your family, your finances. Definitely, I feel like you have already children. Libra. Let's see what's going on about your monetary and finances. I see you traveling because of your job. There is a new job opportunity, a bonus, a promotion on your way, a new contract. Feeling exciting again here with judgment. You're trying something different. You're not the same. We have the dust cut again. Closing a chapter. Definitely it's a big period of transition. It's why I see you working collaboration, formation, a trying. Let's see what's going on here. Maybe there is a formation in a different place, a city here. It's about being creative, artistic, doing what you love, what you've been passionate about. With judgment, we have the nine of cups. The universe is gifting you what you really want, Libra. With the dust card, it's a new job offer. So ace of wands. Increase your creativity. Believe in yourself, Libra. Do your best. 
money is on your way. See you signing a contract, a document. There is a masculine energy here, a colleague of you, a boss. This person is supporting you here, okay? You can be proud of yourself. Let's see, an advice for you, Libra, next month. Accept this breakup, this ending here. Take your time to heal. Your friends are here for you. It's a lot of support. Libra, you're not alone. Your advice with the Six of Cups is telling me that you're feeling nostalgia, thinking a lot about your past. Okay? For some of you, you're missing someone from your family. It was talking about a difficult loss. Focus on the positive to attract positive things. Libra. What you don't see coming, it's you closing your chapter here. End of a cycle, an accomplishment, success and victory. You did it. Libra. Libra, this is your reading. Thank you so much for watching. Being here. Take care. Bye.